Alright, good morning everyone. Hi guys, I'm Shelly. And I am Mike with Camping with the Converse. Camping with the Converse, except we're not camping today. No, it's cruising with the Converse this week. Special edition brought to you from the Grand Cayman Islands. Grand Cayman Islands. Yeah. And today's a very special day. It is our anniversary today. So. Yay! We're gonna go in and see some stingrays and turtles and stuff. Yeah. Uh, let you guys know how it goes. Cayman is the largest of the trio. It has an extension of 76 square miles, 22 miles long, and 4 miles wide on the widest point by the east. The rest of the island it is approximately from 1 to 3 miles wide. Cayman Brack and Little Cayman are called the sister islands. The current population among the three islands it is close to 73,000 people today. The main industries in the Cayman Islands are tourism besides the financial industry. There is a high season for tourism. There are 90, approximately 90 uh, hotels, luxury hotels, condominiums and resorts. The islands are financial paradise. We don't pay taxes here. Sounds good, right? No taxes. Yes. There are uh, approximately 400 banks. And the island has its own currency, the Cayman Island dollar. It has an exchange rate of 80 cents Cayman dollars equal to one American dollar. The American dollars, the exchange rate is fixed. Fixed exchange rate, never change. And this, uh, uh, this is a currency we can uh, use here beside the Cayman dollars. We can pay in cash with uh, U.S. dollar. People are on that. There's four people on that stand up paddle board out there. Okay. It might be two different ones. No, it's all one, isn't it? Uh, yeah. This water looks like a swimming pool. It is so crazy. Mm -hmm. On our way to hell.
didn't say we never said. I meant to send the. I meant to send the hugs and kisses one for Lena. Like it's been that one to Teddy and Tori. Not that I don't love the hugging kisses, but. Then which one did Elena get? It's a picture of the Hell Rock formation and okay. the, the side of that building. Of course, I'm shopping, and Michael's in line for food. What are you gonna get? So tell me what you got to eat. It is a patty, what they call them. Good man, chicken or beef. We got the chicken. I have no idea what's in there. But uh, it's a little spicy, it's really good. They're hot. It's a good little snack. Cayman Island food. Right. Little Doritos to go with it. Yeah, two patties, Doritos, soda, and a pack of Skittles. Such a, such a kid. 12 bucks. get on a boat to go out to a sandbar to pet and feed and kiss stingrays. Mm -hmm. Hopefully they don't kiss you back. Yeah, I think they said it's a 25 minute boat ride out to the sandbar, so we'll see.
Okay, that was super fun. I have um, done like a little stingray thing before, but it was in like they were in captivity. This is amazing. I know my hair is around, guys, but it's kind of super fun. It's a little breezy though, and the water's super warm. Probably won't even get to use this audio from the wind, but I'll try. I just farted on our room stool. <laughs> so I ran around and gave him a 20. So, so we were at the club. <laughs> and so we were all sitting like in a semicircle, <laughs> like we are right now. Yeah. <laughs> and we're, it's the end of the night. And someone, Megan, brings up booby, booby, booby. <laughs> Let's do boobies, boobies, boobies. Boobies, boobies, boobies to the right. And then someone said, Let's reverse that. Francis did boobies, boobies to me first. I'm not gentle. I got Tanya sitting next to me, which is great, because she's a she's a good set. I don't I don't think this happened. It did happen. Did I ask? <laughs> did he ask for permission? No, he didn't get you asked. No. Well, I apologize. Hi guys, we just wanted to give you a quick review of our trip. Uh, we're on our last night of our cruise outside enjoying this nice beautiful sunset behind us and we just wanted to give you our last closing thoughts. Yeah, so this is our first cruise so you know we really had nothing to compare it to but I'm pretty impressed. I think uh, the service was really good. A lot of people were complaining that it was really busy um, but I didn't think it was too bad. The food was good. Yeah, the food was good. The service was really good, really great, actually. I know that there were a lot of new staff on this ship, but everybody was just super helpful and friendly. So we were really happy about that. And drinks we got, were good. Yeah, the drinks were always good. And we got really good weather, too. I really love the uh, variety of restaurants and, like, you know, several different cocktail bars and all of that. And I guess my favorite ship thing, my, sorry, my favorite ship thing, and I'm sorry, my hair, the wind, uh, was all the great people that we met. I mean, we met so many people from all over the country and Canada. Especially Minnesota. <laughs> a lot of Minnesota, a lot of Canada, but everybody just really friendly. So I guess when you catch people on vacation, they tend to be in a good mood. Great. Yeah. And off ship. There was a lot of great things that happened off ship, but I would say the stingray that we found on the beach just out in the wild was probably one of my favorite things, but there were, there's a lot of favorite things that you guys have to uh, yeah. stick around and see. And since I wasn't really a part of chasing that down, even though I am the one that, like, Michael was up getting drinks and I yelled for him to go get it, uh, mine was uh, when we were in 
Grand Cayman and we took a boat charter out off the off the shore like six miles and um, to a sandbar and just swam with stingrays. That was just really cool. Yeah, the water out in the wild. looks like pool water. I mean, I know you've already seen it, I've already showed you, but just that's that's why it was my favorite. Last night so going out for steak. Yes. And we take off tomorrow morning yes. back to the cold weather. Sad so. day. So Michael, big question. Yep. I know you love your camper, you love your RV, you love to be in control in that in that space and having your own things. Would you go on another cruise? Absolutely. You? I was gonna say, are you gonna ask me? Um, I've already asked, like, can we put a deposit down for next year before we go? We'll see. I'm not sure. So we'll let but, you know. All right. See you guys. Thanks guys. Keep your adventures going. Bye.